Welcome to this quick tutorial on how to poach eggs. I'll talk a little bit later about how to do it, but right now all we're going to be doing is whisking some heated water over a medium heat. Now we've got a nice vortex happening, this is the time we can drop our eggs in. Uh, drop them in from a bowl, don't drop them in individually. As you can see when we stick our eggs in, the white of the egg starts to wrap around the yolk and this is what we want so everything sticks together and the yolk and white doesn't separate out. Right, just while they're cooking, I'd like to say a little bit about how to actually do it. Now the water we've got, you can add some vinegar. Vinegar helps keep the egg from separating also. Never stick salt in. Salt acts as a separating agent between egg. So always stick your salt in afterwards. Now as for the eggs themselves, you want some good quality free range eggs. You don't want some old eggs, otherwise you'll find when you put them into the bowl to begin with that the egg white has already separated from the yolk and the white doesn't hold form very well so you can disregard those eggs you're never going to get something beautifully cooked as some good fresh free range eggs just another thing you don't want the water to be too hot so it's boiling you want it to be if anything simmering nicely just have enough warmth to cook the egg believe me good things take time and these are certainly one of those things if you've got patience then you're well on the way to creating some nice poached eggs now every so often just give the eggs a bit of a, a lift in the water with a utensil. This is just make sure it doesn't stick to the bottom and everything starts cooking evenly. Now after about three minutes you should start to notice that the egg is starting to cook quite nicely and there's a nice envelope encasing the yolk. When you think it's ready all you want to do is remove the egg from the water and then touch it lightly with your finger. Now if it jiggles too much, it needs a little bit longer in the water, but if you touch it and it springs back nicely, then it's cooked perfectly. So as you can see here, it's springing nicely. It's got a little bit of a jiggle, and it's perfect. The egg yolk's beautifully and runny inside. So these are ready, so we can take them off, put them on a piece of bread, and slice these bad boys open, and just watch the golden goodness flow. Okay, now you can season with salt and pepper and you're ready to eat these things. So there you have it, it's a really quick video, um, shows you exactly how to make some perfect eggs as you can see, and just follow those steps and I'm pretty sure you should be fine. Thank you for watching Cooking with Students.